It's like meeting two different people, to be honest with you. I prefer Ian, but that's because Susan's in your face. Worst thing about it is obviously embarrassment for me. So you think our other victims have it bad. Our next subject manages to be an embarrassing dad. Oh, dad. And mum at the same time. At number two, tranny dad. Ian is your typical father. He's miserable, he's mongy. Um, he expects me to pay the bills, mainly all the time. Ian is morbid, depressed, stress head. Dress sense, terrible. Absolutely terrible. And uh, you know what? Uh, crappiest trainers with crappiest jeans. Susan just don't care. Susan's like, like. Susan acts like she's about 18, 19 years old and got not got a care in the world. Right, you two. Come on. Who wants kebab? Me. I'm starving. Lee and Jack's dad is happily married 51 year old Ian Platt. Being trans, yeah, it's funny. It's quite funny because it's stereotypes. You've got to be gay. You've got to be weird. You've got to be not normal. It's normal. I do it all the time. It's me. Among the trans community, a, a lot of my friends are straight. And they've got wives, girlfriends. Finding a girlfriend isn't easy if you're trans. But I've always found, tell them. It's like with Lisa, told her within the first hour. He said, I like to dress in women's clothes and... The kind of thoughts go through your head like, oh, right. And I just went, and? So, what's it like having a grumpy dad who transforms into a glamorous, fun-loving woman? I'm here to find out. Jack? Hello. Hello, can I come, come in? Yes, come on. <laughs> Thank you very much. Is it Ian or Susan that embarrasses Su you? Um, Susan embarrasses me. <laughs> in what way does Susan embarrass Um, Just the whole fact that um, it's really outrageous, some of the stuff that she does. I can't wait any longer. Is it all right if I meet Ian? Will it, it be is. Ian or Susan? It will be Ian. Is he upstairs? Yep. Let's holler him down the stairs, shall we? Go on. Ah. Dad. Hello. Ian. Hello. Been hearing all about you. Have you? Yeah. Have you started putting makeup on? Sorry, yes. Yeah. Come, can I chat to you in here? Yes, you can. Ooh, we're off. We're off already. Have you seen this many times before? Many times Jack? before. Too many times. Doesn't bat an eyelid. Doesn't bat an eyelid, does it? How do you get into that? Come on, let just let me see the back of that. How have you laced yourself into that? Have you had 30, help or you just years of hard work. <laughs> practice. Oh. Would you like to be a little darling and run up and get me a brush? Uh, what brush do you need? Uh, a powder brush, please. So he would know what a powder brush is. That's brilliant. Does he normally assist in any way? No, no, no. He's normally there, yeah. But how great <laughs> that he's embraced this so much and allows you to be you. It allows me to be me and do what I want to do and be who I want to be. Look at that. See? He doesn't know, does he? Is that wrong? Well, what, would you put your paper fat powder on with that? Me what powder? Face powder on with that. Oh, no. You've done us wrong there. What were you thinking? Well, yeah. Let's get that wig on and let's get out. Come on, us three. Let's hit the town. Uh, me and you, Jack and Susan. All glammed up, the three of us hit the streets of Leeds to strut our stuff. But for Jack, it's another night of constant ribbing and rubbing up from his dad Susan's many glamorous cohorts. This one especially going out to our lovely Jack, Matt. Hey! Right, big boy. Is this what usually happens to ribbing? And now dad Susan's getting in on the act. And as the evening continues, so does the embarrassment level. Jack, you straight. Straight up the ass. Ah, good old Jack, smiling through the pain. Slightly moist. By the end of the night, I understand how Susan and her mate's outrageous behaviour is embarrassing to Jack, but it's clear he wouldn't put up with it if he didn't rate his dad so highly. He is who he is. I love both sides of him. Well, yes, but Susan, for letting your manhandling mates loose on innocent young Jack, you've won the silver coming in second in our embarrassing Olympics. Yes. Not another yes. club. I can't take the pain. Oh, you can. Oh! Has your mum ever borrowed any of your...